On Wednesday, President Trump announced that Turkey has agreed to a permanent ceasefire on the Kurdish-held Turkish-Syrian border following with the creation of a temporary ceasefire announced by Vice President Mike Pence last week. Trump also said that the U.S. will be lifting the previously imposed sanctions placed on Turkey until, quote, something happens that we're not happy with, end quote. Additionally, on Wednesday, a Google research team achieved, quote, quantum supremacy when one of their quantum computers successfully completed a task in three minutes, which would have taken a standard computer roughly 10,000 years to process. Google CEO Sundar Pichai explained that we are now one step closer to applying quantum computing to, for example, design more efficient batteries, create fertilizer using less energy, and figuring out what molecules might make effective medicines. He also described this as the most meaningful milestone to date in the quest to make quantum computing a reality." End quote. On Tuesday, Chilean President Sebastián Piñera announced economic reforms that will hopefully quell the violent protests that have raged in Chile for the past few weeks. The protests began in the capital of Santiago over the rise in subway ticket cost, but have spread steadily to encompass the entire country. Panera said the basic pension will go up by 20%, the minimum wage will rise, electricity rates will go down, and the government will introduce a new higher tax bracket.